Hello my friends, my name is Mohamed Naveed and in this lecture I am going to teach you Appearance option in WordPress. So what basically appearance option is? If you come in dashboard and if you click on appearance, so definitely it will show you all these options getting me. So the first option is themes. So what basic themes are? As you can see that right now it is showing me themes and themes are nothing. Themes are nothing. It's just like a website. For example, as you can see that this is the layout or you can say the design of, of website. For example, if you if you like this the design or this layout, just click on it. And as you can see that right now it is showing you preview. And if you're satisfied with the preview, just simply click on activate or definitely active. Definitely it will become your website. Getting me. Let's say that I want this website if or if I want this a layout or this website so what I do I will click on themes and as you can see there right now is showing me the preview if I'm satisfied with this what I do I will click on activate and definitely it will become my website getting me so definitely it is nothing themes are nothing it's just like a website getting me and as you can see there right now I have just three themes getting me by default we have just three but if you want more so click on add new or you can if you know the the uh, the name of any theme so definitely you can also type the name so if you don't know, so click on add new and definitely here we have the option of popular, latest and favorites getting me. Right now I don't have internet connection and there's something wrong with my definitely uh, with, with my internet that's why I don't have. But if you have your internet connection that if you go in popular, latest and favorites. So it will show you, it will show you something like this right now as, as it's showing me right now. Okay. okay. So for example, if you go and add new, so it will show you not only three, but it will show you more than three, like 12 or 15 or 13 uh, themes, getting me. And definitely it will show you th free themes, getting me. And if you want to buy new themes, definitely you can also buy theme, getting me. But if you if you go in new, add new, so definitely it will show you free themes, getting me. So what you need to do, if you like any theme, so just simply click on the stall, definitely if you go in there, so definitely it will show you the option stall. And after stalling this, it will show you the option like this, it's showing me right now, getting me. So it will come here and definitely in appearance and definitely if you need to click on up activate and definitely that will become your theme getting me. It's not rocket science. Okay. It's not rocket science. What you need to do? You need to go in definitely add new and it will show you all the themes. Click install and then click again to activate getting me. N not very, not very hard getting me right now. I don't have that's why uh, uh, definitely I cannot show you getting me. So definitely that's why I'm not show you. Otherwise I could show you getting me. Now, uh, definitely if I have this theme, for example, if I download or definitely if I install any theme, for example, if I have internet connection, okay. And let's say that if I have, if I have installed any theme, getting me, and if I want to change the color, if I want to change anything, so how can I change? I have to go in customize. Okay. Right now here, the option is here or the option is also here, getting me. So if you click on customize, so definitely it will show you all the options of customize, getting me. So for example, if I want to change any theme, for example, right now, as you can see there right now, I have this default theme, but let's say if I want to change this theme, so I don't need to go back or uh, definitely I don't no need to select any theme. I can also do here. How can I do? I will just simply click on change. And as you can see there right now, it is showing me themes. Okay. Let's say that if I want this theme, so I will click on this theme and definitely this will become my theme getting me. But right now I don't want, so I will click on customize and definitely it will give me all the options back getting me. Then what do we have next? We have site identity. Site identity is basically for, uh, for example, text. For example, as you can see the right now, here we have the option for set logo. For example, as you can see the right now, I don't have logo. But let's say if I want to give logo here, I will click on set logo and definitely it will open my media. And uh, I say this, okay, Chrome image. And as you can see the right now, as you can see the right now, showing me this picture here, getting me. So it's just like logo, getting me. So if you come to my website, you also see the logo as well, getting me. So same here, if you want to give your logo, you can also give logo here. If you want to give, if you want to change the name of your website, you can also do, uh, as you can see the right now, Navid Place is here. That's why I show Navid Place. Tagline definitely is not online. So definitely you can write whatever you want. Last, what do we have? We have uh, definitely set image. Set image is basically for here, getting me. So basically if you come here, so definitely is, as you can see the right now is showing this getting me. So let's suppose if I want to show any picture here, if I want to show any picture, so what I do, I will come here and I will click on select image. As I click on it, as you can see the right now, again, it is open my uh, different media. And this time I will say there this, I will click on select and uh, if I save and publish. If I save and publish and if I refresh it, 
yeah as you can see that right now it's showing me this getting me so basically if you want to show if you want to change the uh, definitely if you want to change the image of this or picture of this definite icon definitely you can also do here getting me uh, then what do we have next here? we have color let's suppose if I want to change the color so I can also change here I will click on color and I have to change the color okay so if I say the background color so I have to click on sec se select color or if I say this color as you can see that right now I have this background color getting me and if I want the background or definitely base color th scheme definitely I have the yellow, pink, getting me. So it's looking good. Blue is also looking good, getting me. So I also themed. Uh, if I want to change the color, uh, header and slider, text color, definitely. If I want to change the color, I can also change here, getting me. So definitely, this is basically for color, getting me. So definitely, you can change the color of anything. Uh, then what do we have next? So we have header image. So definitely, uh, if I want to change the header image, I can also change yes, this image, getting me. So if I want to give the header image, I can also give and let's suppose if i want to change the background image let's say that uh, oh if i go in header image and if i say add new image or if i say this image okay okay as you can see that right now it's showing me this image getting me so basically this is Im uh, header image getting me but if i don't want uh, let's suppose uh, as you can see that now it's, look, no, it's not looking good so i will click on hide image and it will not show image here getting me so this is him uh, you can see header image uh, then uh, definitely I will go again customize and then what do we have next we have background image let's suppose if you want big uh, if you want image background if you want image in background so you need to come here you need to click on background image select the image and let's say that this image okay choose okay as you can see there in the background as you can see in the background you can see this image getting me so let's say that if you want to change the image you can also change here we have the option for example as you can see there right now i have image po po position option position option if i want center left right definitely i can also change getting me here i also have the option for fit size or fit to screen or full screen getting me so definitely i also have the option for this getting me and then uh, if i if i don't want or if if i don't want this picture i will click on remove or if i want to change let's suppose in the place of this if i want another i will click on change image and again it will open this and definitely in this i can select any picture getting me for example let's say that this time i want this i will click on suit image as you can see that right now i is showing me this picture getting me so this is uh, definitely background image means the background if you want to show any picture definitely you can also show here uh, then we have the option for different menus uh, as you can see the right now I don't have any menus so let's say if I want to get one if I want to create a new menu so I will come here and I will click on menus and definitely I will come here and uh, I will click on add a new menu I have to give name to this new menu so I say the new menu and then I will click on create menu and here I have the options and if I want the add items so definitely it will open my pages getting me so uh, i have right now one two three four five right now i have five pages and if i want uh, this page i have to just click click on this click 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 and just click getting me so you can see that right now i have all this option or the all the pages getting me so in this menu in this menu i have these pages getting me after this what i do i will click on save and publish and uh, publish so as you can see the now is completed and if i come here and if i refresh the page so definitely as you can see that right now i have menu i have all this getting me so if i come here i have definitely all the menus getting me so definitely showing me this thing getting me so let's suppose if i want menu if i have anything so what i do i will come here and i will click on menus and again i can change the menu here and then what do we have next we have header means definitely this is the head part and definitely this is the last the food part getting me so let's say that if i want to change something in head part i can also change getting me and then uh, if i again go in customize and here we have widgets widgets are very very useful if i click on widgets or if if i directly go there it will be good if i come here widgets as you can see that right now i have all the widgets getting me and uh, widgets are nothing widgets are nothing for example if i come in website so definitely the left side whatever you are seeing getting me for example if you are coming here so as you can see that right now i have this pose this search this image or anything 
So let's say that if I want to add something, as you can see that right now I have this calculator. Oh, sorry, this uh, calendar. Getting me. So let's say if I want calendar, if I don't want anything, so what I do, I for example, if I want search here, if I don't want search here, so I will come here and definitely I will click on delete. And at this time, if I go and refresh this page, and if I come here top, as you can see that right now I don't have search bar. Getting me. And let's say that if I don't want this also, delete. Uh, if I don't want anything, delete. Or if I come here, I say delete. Getting me. So as you can see that right now, uh, I have deleted something, and I don't have main thing. If I refresh this, as you can see that right now we don't have anything. Getting me. Let's say that if I don't want this calendar here. So I will come here and I find I will find the calendar. So I say calendar, calendar. Okay, here the calendar. I will come here and I will click on delete. And if I go and refresh this page, and if I say if I scroll down, as you can see that now you are not able to see any uh, definitely uh, calendar. Getting me. So let's say that if you want something here, if you want anything, so what you need to do, you need to come here and you you have to go in uh, widgets. And if you want anything, for example, right again I want calendar here at top. So what I do, I I, I have some definitely widgets getting me. So for example, let's say that if I want to widget this uh, calculator here, so what I do, I will just simply click and drag this here. Okay, okay I say oh, save, and this time if I go and refresh this page, and if I come on top, as you can see that right now I have this calendar getting me, getting me. So definitely in this way we can put any uh, widgets getting me. I will go again in customize and definitely here we have study for an additional CSS. Let's say that if you are good in CSS and if you want to add your own CSS, definitely you can also put getting me. So what is CSS? CSS is nothing, it's just a language like HTML and we use CSS to make a website look better getting me. So this is our lecture on appearance option in uh, WordPress. I hope you have understood for more videos, lecture and exercises. Come to my website www.navithpress.com. Allah will fear my Allah and I will meet you in the next lesson. Till then, Allah Hafiz.